If you didn't know it was there, it might be easy to overlook Jones College. Housed in a high-rise along the St. Johns River off Arlington Expressway, the institution has provided thousands of students with an education since the mid-1960s, while providing beautiful music to thousands of people all over the world. This is Jones College Radio, WKTZ in Jacksonville, Florida, broadcasting live to the Internet 24 hours a day. After joining the family business decades ago, Kenneth Jones has held numerous positions at the school that bears his father's name. But it is his role as general manager of the school's two radio stations that he says is a combination of all of his talents. And with the help of a limited number of volunteers, Jones operates WKTZ 90.9 FM, WJAX AM 1220 from a small studio on the second floor. This music segment is brought to you by... The Taylor Show. Primarily, the big star here is the music. Our format of music is not necessarily the most uh, utilized format, and um, and because of that, there there are not a lot of stations that that play what we play, and therefore they come to us looking for the music they love and find it here at Jones College Radio, no matter where they live in the United States or for that matter around the world. Without listener support and the support of our sponsors, we wouldn't have the music so sweet to the ear and that our hearts love to hear. Jones College students once helped spin the popular easy listening records that now line the walls of the Jones College offices. As in many broadcast operations, that process has been turned over to computers. Nonetheless, Jones says the musical desires of his station's listeners are still at the heart of his operation. Amazing. I'm in the Frank section. You know, there's some folks that come to me and say that this format、um, is is going away or dying, but we have a, an extremely popular station in this market, and indeed across the country. It's a, it's a very popular、uh, thing that we do here, so it's it's certainly not over yet. So I would say that there's a bright future for us, as long as I keep several things in mind. I think certainly the the quality of the music and the listeners and what they they want. To hear,、um, trying to keep it fresh with with the new artists as long as it fits our format. And it's that format that Jones believes will keep Jones College Radio operating for many years to come. If you had to sum up your format in one sentence, what would you call it? Beautiful music. That's it. That's short and sweet, but that's it. Beautiful music. You're listening to the station of great favorites, 12:20 a.m. WJAX with America's best music. For more on Jones College Radio, check out Matt Sorgel's article in the Florida Times Union. For Jacksonville.com, I'm Amanda Warford.